In tonight's Dirty Dining, a repeat offender. She tried to convince us a lack of soap was the problem in her restaurant. Plus, a Taco Bell ordered shut after the inspector sees insects landing on the food. Here's local 10 investigator Jeff Weinsier with tonight's Dirty Dining Report. What inspection? Last week? Oh. The outside of this place says C and Y Chinese restaurant. The inspector says it's Y and C restaurant. Whatever it's called, we're at 1242 Northeast 163rd Street. It is in North Miami Beach. It's across from the mall. Last week, an inspector was here based on a consumer complaint. Noted 31 violations and ordered the place shut. They uh, should have a soap uh -huh. uh, in the thing right. uh, when we work. Uh, we can close. Uh, so she found hand. an issue with soap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's like uh, everything. And hand washing. We, yeah, everything have a standard. Is she really trying to convince us a lack of soap is the problem here? What about the rodent issue? Uh, what rodent? Rat, mice, mouse, rodent. I don't know. We didn't see the mouse in here. There was rodent droppings. The what they drop? Their poo poo. No. We no. didn't see that. Well, you didn't, see that, no, no. The, you didn't see that, but the inspector saw that. Where? Maybe that's the problem. In this room off the kitchen, the inspector noted 40-plus rodent droppings underneath a storage container of rice, 30-plus rodent droppings on canned goods. There were rodent droppings on a bag of flour. Roach droppings were spotted on a sink. There were cans of Raid, which is a no-no. Extermination must be done by the professionals. All cutting boards were soiled with food debris. There were hand washing issues, an objectionable odor in the bathroom and other areas of the establishment, and that was a repeat violation. You're telling me hand washing, no soap at the sink, but it was a lot worse than that. We are very sorry. Okay. Sorry, but this is the second time we've been here. This place also ordered shop back in 2018. We now move up to Hollywood. This Taco Bell is on Sterling Road. It is east of I-95 on the outskirts of Oakwood Plaza. Wanted to talk to someone about flies landing on the lettuce, flies landing on the tomato, flies landing on the tortilla chips. That fly infestation leading to the inspector ordering the doors shut. Can't say. Okay, anybody have an explanation? The manager here says she's going to call another manager. Despite the fact the flies were landing on food and they were ordered shut, there are no air curtains installed on any of the doors to keep those flies out. You have to leave. Okay. You want us to leave or leave? Yeah. No problem. Would you want to eat in a restaurant, though, that had flies landing okay, on the no lettuce? Comment. Bye -bye. No comment. No comment. The inspector also noted no proof of required state-approved employee training. We left a business card for someone to call us. No one ever did. Both places just mentioned were allowed to reopen following an ordered cleanup and then a reinspection. Jeff Weinseer, Local 10 News.